Oh, hey, Mithril Axe. That's a new place. I found the new place. Oh, no. Yeah, that gives me uh, 30 more attack. Yay. <laughs> Welcome back, Welcome back to the Sims Fromia. Man, come on. On the last episode, we taught you how to find a holy cloak and take shitty notes. <laughs> and on, walk around in circles. On man. this episode, um, we make up for all that. I'm really good at walking around in circles, I'm just saying. Alright, now explain to these fine folks uh, everything that you screwed up and how they can fix it. Uh, I screwed up everything in my life. Help him fix it, everybody. Yeah, please? Let's see, I did that, and then there's only two more items to get, I believe. So, you change this to the blue. That guy's a... Oh, okay. I thought he was just running at nothing. Ah! <laughs> you throw graves? Oh, Alright, let's see how it is. Look at my sweet new Mithril axe. That actually is pretty awesome. That's the nice thing about this game, that they actually, like, show the different weapons and everything, at least. Don't most games do that? Not back then, man. Back then? Back when I was a little kid playing the GameCube game system? I mean, how many RPGs back then did you have that were like that? Uh, 26. Oh. Yep. Revive Ring. Right? So if you equip a Revive Ring... Then you come back to life right when you die. Well, if you're lucky, I would never take that off, and I would be immortal. If you are lucky, a revive ring and a life bottle, immortality. So I do those, and then you go to the top, then and then you go, you go to pink. the top, then you go to the lock, and, and then you, you go to the, the door, save the and thingy, and then the, the slot A, and you save on a million different save slots because you're an ass. Yeah, good job. Go up. Uh! It's actually shooting us through the mana cannon. Oh, yeah. Mana cannon, lavender. We're gonna blast off. Oh, God! Oh god, his eyes. Look at me, I killed this turtle. I'm inside of his clothes. I hate this guy. I hate his fucking outfit, man. He just looks like he took pieces of things and just put them on top of himself. Die! Uh, that's really mean. It looks like he just has like little wings. <laughs> Aw, he's a butterfly man. It's me, masturbating underwater. Mm -hmm. oh, shit. Aw, prisoners. What is this? Oh, are they gonna die? While we watch. How could you do that? They'll all be killed. Damn you. Oh, don't worry, it stopped. Your wings fell off. I like his green chucks. Yeah. Stop the water now! No! It's too late. I can't! I know how! <laughs> yeah. His cloak <laughs> jiggles. Yeah. I'm sure you intend to shut down what kind of cloak is that that it's so rigid? <laughs> I don't know. It's weight. plastic. He's wearing plastic. <laughs> it's too much starch. <laughs> She's look look at her face when she says that. She seems like she's into it. I've been doing math all night and I really want to kill something and then put it back together. Even that eyesore of a tower will fall before my cannon. Rod's big rod. Just take it off. Look, it extends like a foot from it. How is it on? Are there tiny thrusters on the inside of it that keep it floating right there? It has to be heavy. It's not even touching him. How can it be heavy? I think I'll 
I mean, it has to be hard to like get through doorways, sit on chairs. How does he sit down? He slides out of it. Maybe he's got a toilet inside of it. <laughs> oh my god, he's even uglier. What the fuck, Rhode Isle? That's unfair. <laughs> this is gonna be cake. <laughs> really? He turns into that it's monstrosity? That's immediately what he says. This is gonna be cake. He's got a blade that is twice the size of your body. And Just the attached. blade is a part of his body. The body blade. Are we. Is this legitimately gonna be the end of Rodile? Maybe. Oh, I hope so. Wouldn't that be nice? Is this his final form? It's not even his final form, bro. Uh, for the sake of this video, we'll just call this Golden Rodile. He's summoning Undini. Oh. Neat. No need of her. Whoa. So many directions. This is pretty. Dance club, dance it off. Bitch. Dance, dance, infatuation. Dude had a little bit of help on him. Now I'm over limited? Oh, he's fucked. Oh, man. Now he's over limited? Ah, he's still fucked. You got birds in your brain. <laughs> Bird brain. Look at all that grade, man. That's a big grade. Three grade from one fight. I'm that guy that commented and said you had to play eight times to get 10,000 grade. Fuck you. Hey. Just kidding. Not, not, not fuck you. But... No, thank you. Yeah. Thank you for watching. Thank you all. <laughs> all 12 of you. Oh, God. <laughs> What's happening? My body. My bugs! My bugs! He's got a cactus for an arm. Look at that. I'm out of here. You don't trick me. Beep! Don't hit the big button. Beep. <laughs> <laughs> I like how his sunglasses became like a part of him. He I didn't turned, notice that. Like the his eyes were the same color as his no. sunglasses. Well, we, we didn't fucking do it. <laughs> Let all the prisoners die. Rodile is just that kid that won't let anyone play with his toys. If he's not having fun, nobody's having fun. Professor! I know, but I can't do this by myself. I would need at least seven other people. We'll take over from here. The rest of you, go. Voting! There'll be what? plenty of time for chit chat later. Hmm. Leave now. Okay. Okay. Just one little hand. Maybe here and there. Dink. 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 Beep. Bloop. Bloop. Blurp. What? Uh oh. <sighs> shit, I'm out of here. I quit. They just keep working on that no. shit. We've got to open that door. Nonchalant. <laughs> yeah, they don't notice the water. Use your hands. Okay. <laughs> not even now when your lives depend on it. Well, you no, just... it's not for our lives. I mean, they just sacrifice themselves so that we can leave. Why would they do oh. that? If the door opens, this I feel like we didn't even get to know Boda before he and expired. The ceiling is covered by a dome. Nope. There's nowhere for the water to escape. They did it to save us. And then no, we explode we and they get away. <laughs> Good job. Damn it. Isn't there anything we can do? We've stopped nope. the self-destruct system. Boda! Open Boda. the door! Oh, Boda! Oh, no! We'll always have Silverunt. Goodbye, Lloyd. In order to fire mana at the Great Seed. Now that we've finished reprogramming this control room, our mission is complete. We need you to get the message to Ewan that we have succeeded. No. Open the door now. Wait, why can't he open the door? Success in regenerating the world. I don't even know. Couldn't he open it and just go over there? And you would think. You don't have to do this, right? You know that, right? Oh, that's convenient. No! Double door. Man, there's people drowning, like, right on the other side of that. <laughs> I bet it looks horrific. Creatures? Oh. Three of those? What are those I mean, we killed two of those they and, like, the big one earlier. Their cages probably Did we? When the yeah. System was Remember we fought the gigantic dragon head? Here they to get Colette back? 
Yeah, but didn't we lose that episode? Yeah. Sorry, guys. The lost episode where we fought dragons. Yeah. It was probably our best. It was, like, super funny. You should have been there. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. He got fucked up. Let's go ahead and baby dragon him a little bit. I didn't know that dragons had to throw their head forward to get the fireball to come out of their head. Yeah, man. That's how they aim it. Oh. It just seems like you got a lot of recoil. Yeah, they got to pitch it a little bit, you know? Snapping your neck like that. What if he broke his neck while he was doing it? Wait, we just killed those. These are their brothers. There are too many of them. <laughs> no, there are three that. many of them. <laughs> Come on, man. We killed three of those in like five if seconds. We we'll never be able to pass on Boda's message. Because we'll be we dead. How does he just know how to play it? Suddenly? What if he played it like Celine Dion or something? Eh. Do you know any Enya? Well, that was cool. That? There's still too many. Oh, poop. Boop. Water. My only weakness. Oh. Was that a summon spirit? Who would have ever thought that any amount of water would fall on me? <laughs> huh? Oh. That's Mythos's voice. What's Mythos doing here? Please get on Called the him. Start. Let's worry about the how and why later. All right. He literally gave you that to summon him. Yeah, for real. Why are you surprised? It worked. Be happy. He's better than all of you. It's really you. But what was that attack just now? And how did you get a read? That was a water attack. I'm sorry. I was worried about all of you and I just couldn't stay behind. So I asked the renegades to let me borrow a reart. You have any sure. idea how loud it would be? Yeah. <laughs> what? I, don't I can't hear you. Speak up. I heard the flute. I tried my best to get inside, so I just started blasting the dome with fireball. Then and then he used my water balls. Golden sparkling bird appeared and helped me. Golden sparkling bird. Could it be? Those look fun to ride. It can't. They really do. Why would a summon spirit? What do you mean? Do you think Genus called Aska when he played the flute? Mythos's flute? I wonder. No. His other we flute that he had. The flute yeah. Itself to find out Dumb. the truth. But shouldn't we rest first? Let's head back to Palma Costa. I must apologize to Neil. I left without telling him. All right. It's not like we'll figure anything out by dwelling about it here. Let's head back. Good idea. Thank you, Mythos. We owe you our lives. I'm too short to drive this. I didn't realize how amazing. Oh, we're not friends. <laughs> Don't kid yourself. Stupid kid. Everyone, you're back, but barely. Neil, I'm sorry. Forgive me, Neil. Oh, I'll forgive you as long as my friend Boda is still alive. Where are you, Boda? Boda drowned. <laughs> Boda's dead. Boda was he eaten. broke the flute? You bitch. I don't know who that was anyways. Can't believe you broke the flute. It, it, it's alright. It was very old. It wasn't a flute. But thank you. It was a pan pipe. Pan flute. It was a pan pipe. Yeah, they're, they're called flutes too. Pan, pan flute. pipe. Okay. The item was called a pan pipe, okay? Doody 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 but my sister said that it was made from the nut of a tree that became extinct long ago. That's cool. The nut of an extinct tree. That knowledge may be useful. <laughs> Let's go go tell Blue Blue Hair about his dead friend. Oh no, he's gonna be really sad about that. Yeah, my ex fear. I don't care. Well, what's this dog? Peep Pepe. Name him. Oh, wait, we don't have her. He already has a name, man. Oh, he did? I it's didn't Pepe. see it. Pepe? Pepe or Peep. Pepe? Pepe Rowney? Yeah, it could be either or. Was he doing a little Tim Heidecker eye right there? So, I think that's about it for this episode. Tune in next time for the next episode. Well, we do stuff. Bye. Goodbye forever. Next time. They told me I have too much cod. Boy, you got too much cod in them pants. Something's fishy.
Because he caught a fish. Yeah. I know. So what's that go? What's going on with that barrel? I don't know, man. It's, it's pretty interesting, though. Hey, 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 hey. Could you hit the, hit the mouse a little bit over there? And play with the mouse a little bit? Left mouse. The left mouse? Just not the left mouse button, just the mouse. Just no, 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 not left. The, the left one. This one? No. The, this the, one. the right one. That one? 